Many people believe the only way to advance in their career is to leave their current company. And the results of a new survey indicate, uh-oh, they might be right. Here to explain and give us some tips on maneuvering this potential minefield is Susan Chesney of Robert Half International. This surprises me. So tell me what the survey showed. Survey showed that 29% uh, of uh, companies do tend to hire outside and not promote within. Hmm. Uh, when it's time to move and advance individuals, so. Uh, it, was there some, is there some reasoning behind that? Or that's just sort of looking at the trend and the tendencies? Um, you know, I think in, companies probably don't do a lot of succession planning, mm -hmm. perhaps, is what's uh, motivating that. And also when it's mm -hmm. time to, to hire or promote or look for individuals to move up within the organization, maybe they don't have the current skill set. Right. Perhaps they're looking for somebody with some fresh ideas or some industry experience to come in. Now, I know that I always have a hard time asking for, for what I want in these types of situations. It's always uncomfortable to broach the, the topic of, of money. <coughs> so I wonder, does this, do you think, have anything to do with people just being having a little trepidation when it comes to asking for a promotion? Perhaps. You know, I think a lot of people are not always thinking about their career and how they will progress within an organization. Mm -hmm. um, probably a good idea to really start addressing that is the initial interview um, to see how the organization views individuals for advancement, if they support, if they train, uh, provide mentorship in those areas. Um, and then, um, you know, if, if, if they're available for advancement, then. Mm -hmm. Now, is there a good time or a right time to, to broach that topic? I mean, you say, yeah, sure, at the outset, make it clear that you do want to advance, but if you're having those thoughts and thinking, maybe I have to leave, is that a good time to talk about it with your boss? No, it's probably a good idea to really, just as opportunity presents itself, mm. um, individuals really should be stepping up in their current role. If you're a strong performer, if you're solutions oriented, if you're flexible, if you volunteer to take on projects, you're gonna be somebody who's catching the eye of management. So when there's opportunities, just to, to ask your boss what you need to do right. to be somebody that would be considered for advancement. Okay, so wait for it to present itself in some way. Lots of people think that they need to wait until performance evaluation, your annual performance, and that's probably not the best idea mm -hmm. because maybe there's something that's coming up. Maybe you are too late. Maybe an opportunity has come along that would have been something that you would have been considered for if you were open to having the discussion along the way. Now, what if your spidey senses are telling you, you know what, I really think this isn't going to happen. Is there a way to tell that maybe your, your employers don't see you as promotable, that you've hit the ceiling? Well, I think if you're having those honest discussions along the way, um, you may view yourself, sometimes individuals view themselves in a little bit different capacity than their managers. So if you're having the open, honest discussion along the way, what do I need to do to be considered, and you are moving along towards that, and you're feeling like you're getting the support, um, you know, it's probably worth staying and investing in mm -hmm. that. It's always easier to move up within your current employer. Um, they like you, they value you, they want to give you an opportunity. Um, there may be a point in time where that next step just doesn't really exist for you. Mm -hmm. At that point, when you do step out to market to look for your next opportunity, it's going to bode well if you've already had some advancement within your current organization because they'll look at you as somebody that was valued in the organization. You are somebody that's respected, that's doing a great job, and uh -huh. that bodes well for you when you do go out to market to look. Uh, great topic, Susan. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. Oh, my pleasure. Links to Robert Half International on breakfasttelevision.ca.